Hello, everybody. Wherever you are in the world, this is David. I'm still alive. I am, uh, well, today is, let me start with that. Today is um, June 6th, and that marks three years since I got my stem cell transplant. Uh, all fresh new cells, so technically I'm three years old today, so happy birthday to me. Um, yeah, and I'm out here in on my balcony uh, in the bright sun, um, but it just seemed like the right time to do it and the right place to do it. Um, I am uh, working on my uh, my plants, my, my garden, I guess you could call it a garden. Let's see if I can do this. Um, I might have to change the camera. Let me see if I can do this. No. All right, we're gonna have to do it this way. So, somewhere over here, let's see if I can get it. I can't even see it. I've got my, um, let's back up. Let's see if that works. Here we go. Okay, so here's my garden. These are actually right here, this guy, these are actually radishes. And I just cut the tops off and stuck them in water for a couple days and then eventually threw them in dirt at a random time and here they are. And especially this guy, he's got flowers. So he's my star. Um, and there was, I, I planted them really close together because I honestly didn't know if they were gonna grow or not, and they did, and I and I just pulled out about four of them, and I moved them over to here. You can see those four, and I just moved them into their own containers. They should be happy. Um, they're not looking real good though, so I'm starting to regret that I moved them, but it may be just, you know, it's shock, and it's so hot here. Um, this weekend is the first uh, well, I mean, we've had some flirting with the heat uh, up to now, but this is like, it seems like the first weekend in the 90s, and it's just crazy hot. And so I'm honestly not sure how any of these plants will do. Last year, um, I had to water them uh, three times a day, and if I forgot for one day, they were gone. It was just, uh, it was brutal hot. And I think it's partly because we're on the fifth floor here, and so it's just like a straight attack from the sun. Um, so if it's a plant that doesn't quite want to be in the sun all day, um, they're in trouble. Um, but anyway, that's what we got. Uh, I've got mostly radishes for whatever reason, um, just because I was lazy and I was cutting them and well, also because of the ones that grew. So here's more radishes. They're little and you can see they are spread out, but it's just if they grow, they're gonna be, um, they're gonna be all munched together. And I've got more down here uh, and over there, I've got some random things. There's even a plant there, I have no idea what it is. Um, there's some peas there on the end in a little round container, but there's a, a little square container that's got, looks like might be a little tree. And I don't know what it is, it wasn't intended, but I was like, whatever, let's let it go. Let's let it grow. And so, and then I've got uh, aloe vera over here, which I actually had to use this last weekend because I got sunburn. So, uh, that's what's going on other than all the stuff you already know the pandemic and economic crisis and um, riots in the streets so everything's pretty normal I'm just happy that I got all, of, all my medical stuff done before the world went crazy um, because I can imagine it would have been much harder to get chemotherapy and stem cell transplant and all that stuff uh, while there's a pandemic going on. So I'm very happy that uh, I got all that done and that's in the past. And as far as I know, I'm doing good. Every time I go to see the, the um, oncologist, he's kind of almost annoyed with me. Like, why are you here? You're, you're so healthy. Um, and my blood numbers are are about as high as they have ever been. Um, so, you know, it's good. Uh, the only other things that are going on are 
let's see, I got new glasses. I got two, two sets of new glasses. Um, this is one of them. And the other one is for uh, like in front of the computer. So I don't have those on right now. And um, I have masks. Oh, by the way, I have, that's a University of Florida mask. Um, I just washed it. Uh, so I was drying it in the sun. And um, yeah, it's the University of Florida. I have nothing else uh, too exciting to tell you. I'm standing up because my my feet are hurting. Let's see, that's my balcony. Oh gosh, I forgot to tell you, yeah, I'm growing my hair out. And um, why? Because I can, you can't take hair for granted. I didn't have hair for a period. Uh, so, you know, if you get hair, it's a thing. It's a big deal. So uh, I will cut it eventually. Um, I mean, the I don't want to go to a barber right now. So this is just growing and it is what it is. Um, and then this stuff I could cut any day. You know, if I have an important meeting or something in person, I might cut it. But um, when do you have a chance to grow your hair out? I mean, seriously, um, for guys anyway. So I'm just letting it go and then I'll cut it whenever. So that's about it. I'm gonna go in and have some coffee. It's uh, probably decaf because it's about 4.30 or five. Um, maybe tea, maybe I'll have tea instead, I don't know. And then uh, begin the, the evening festivities. So I wish you all a happy Saturday or a happy weekend whenever you see this and uh, stay grounded in spite of all the things that are going on. All right, bye-bye.